A landmark movie theater at the Jersey Shore is getting a second chance after closing during the pandemic. News 12 New Jersey's John Bathke takes us there in his continuing coverage of the pandemic's impact on entertainment. A century after it first opened, Atlantic Cinemas in Atlantic Highlands will once again welcome moviegoers after going dark during the pandemic. As I say to everybody when they're like, congratulations, I'm like, ah, right, well, thank you, you know, I'm freaking out. Tony Zertucci knows this is an uncertain time to be running a movie theater, but the playwright with a film degree who lives in Atlantic Highlands says movies have always fascinated him. He has leased the five auditorium theater closed by its owner operator late last year with plans to reopen next month. I've heard so many people say to me, you know, that's where, uh, you know, I met my wife or had my first date. That's where my parents met. Community nostalgia combined with post pandemic desire to get out and do things are what Zertuche is counting on. Though the box office has been uneven since the pandemic, with as many as 25% of U.S. theaters still closed. A Quiet Place Part 2 scared up a pandemic record in ticket sales. While in the heights, this is going to be an emotional roller coaster, failed to hit the box office high note that the industry anticipated. Right. They're planning some changes in the types of movies that will be shown here. Yes, they'll be blockbusters, but also indie and art house offerings, as well as some of the classics. And the theater will also have a new name The Atlantic. In Atlantic Highlands, John Bathke, News 12, New Jersey. The theater is also planning to do some remodeling before opening back up.